What is going on, A1 gang? We are back with another video. Hey, shout out to Lexus though, man. They hooking us up for real. But uh, right now, I know we did the Lexus ES350 not too long ago, but uh, they had a, a F Sport that I really wanted to do. So we got the 2019 Lexus ES350 F Sport right here. So I'm I'm feeling this F Sport though a lot more than the other. I was feeling the ES350, but now this F Sport man, this F Sport is killing it. So right there you got the F Sport badge. Very nice. Let me get the key out the car real quick. So on the key you got the little F on the back. I got the window sticker on my hand because it wasn't on the window, it was in the inside of the dash. I mean not the dash but the console that's the key right there this is a very beautiful car f sport on the back got the dual pipes and the crazy part is though right i believe when we did the regular es350 it was uh it was at 52,000 too right so i'm gonna show y'all this window sticker in a minute and it's the same price <laughs> man this is a gorgeous car too but uh, let's unlock it so y'all can see them headlights real quick. If they come on, they didn't come on, but we'll, we'll start it up in a few. Let y'all see how it look. But um, bear with me. Let me put the key in my pocket. I'm gonna try to stretch this window sticker out for y'all real quick. So right there, you got the 2019 with the ultra white. So this one, base price is $44,335. Loaded the way it is, $52,410. So let me try to open it up for y'all. So you got the 3.5 liter V6 dual overhead cam, putting out 302 horsepower, 267 foot-pounds of torque. You got the uh, steering wheel mounted paddle shifters as well. All of your good stuff right there. Also, you got um, you got the uh, Apple CarPlay in this one, as you can see right there. Apple CarPlay compatibility and the Lexus Inform system. So with the Lexus Inform system, it's an app that you download on your phone and you get that free for a year. And uh, you can start your car up far away from the car. You could be on the other side of the world as long as you connect it to the vehicle and stuff. You can start the vehicle up and check different maintenance stuff as well. You also got 4G Wi-Fi, four gigabytes of uh, Wi-Fi main uh, with the Lexus and foreign Wi-Fi system. So you get a one year free trial of that. You also get the uh, SOS system free complimentary for the first 10 years of ownership. So as long as you have this vehicle for the first 10 years, you're gonna get the free SOS system as well. You got Amazon compatibility with the Alexa. So you can be like, Alexa, do this or do that, whatever. She's going to talk back to you. You got the smart watch with the Alexa skilling integration. I mean, you got a lot of different stuff, but enough talking about that. F Sport, man. That's that's what you, you here to see. So let's go ahead and drop this off in the car. And we're going to go ahead and start this beauty up. got that F Sport badge so you know that you ain't playing when you got that F Sport. Very silky smooth. Man, Lexus is, they make some of the smoothest engines, them and Toyota. Well, you know, Lexus, Toyota. They make the smoothest engines that I've, you know, been in and revved up and driv, driven. <laughs> Let me say driven, not driv. That ain't even a word. <laughs> but uh, they make some of the smoothest engines I've driven. 
and revved up, you know, they just silky smooth. It may seem loud on camera, but this engine is actually quiet, man. But, uh, very nice and clean underneath the hood. Let's turn on them headlights. We got the headlights on now. Just look at them on that wall, so you know they bright. But uh, we got the tri-beam LEDs in here as well. Let me take a step back. This man, this car is beautiful. Very nice. So let's go ahead and get in the inside real quick. So you got the. Now normally I don't like black leather, but I'm I'm actually feeling this one like a lot. <laughs> I don't know what it is. But um soft touch materials everywhere. Even right here, soft touch. You know, plastic down here, scuff up your, your door, you know. Typical door buttons right here. You got your memory seats. Mark Levison audio. Got the nice design to it. Lexus on the door seal. Let's uh check out the tail lights too. I forgot all about that. Very nice. Very, very, very beautiful, man. I don't know how many times I didn't see it that, but words can't even explain. You got to see this in person. So look at that big screen, man. That's like a 21 inch screen or something like that. That thing is huge. So my seats. Oh, let me show y'all the seats because if you seen the regular ES review that I did, they didn't have seats like this. These, at least I don't remember them having seats like this. These are like some, some exclusive F Sport type seats. And they are heated and cooled. Mine's is like heated right now or something like that's making some noise. Um, that's your gauge cluster. It is digital, but it is like an analog digital. So you can change it. We in um, sport mode, then we in sport plus. So that's eco. And you got normal. You got your paddle shifters right here. Both sides. Big L in the middle. You can see different things that's going on right there. The gear position, miles per hour. Uh, you got blind spot detection, pre-collision, all of that, those safety features this vehicle has it. Let's pop the trunk. I forgot to show y'all the trunk on the uh, LS, so I'm sorry about that as well. Um, we're going to go ahead and look in the trunk real quick. Show you guys how the trunk looks. How much room is in there. So let's go back there. So we did open up the trunk. So as you can see, it's a nice amount of room back there. You got the Lexus F Sport uh, ES mats. So it says F Sport and then it's got the ES right there too. Very nice and carpeted. You got a first aid kit back there too. Got your cargo uh, net. Very nice. Just a nice amount of room back there. Also you got the pass through. Goes from the inside to the back as well. So you got your little trunk releases in there too. Very nice. Hey, how's it going? So I had to ask the guy a question real quick, so I had to cut the camera about a some vehicle I don't want y'all to know about yet. But uh, yeah, nice amount of room in the trunk back here, so we're gonna go ahead and close that. Got your camera right there too. Yeah, this 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 vehicle that I was asking about, <laughs> man, this to me it's an exotic vehicle, so I had to ask about it real quick. But um, yeah, let's get back to the inside of this vehicle though. So right here on the steering wheel, I know we talked about it already, but uh, you got the F Sport down there as well. Then you got the um, the aluminum pedals as well. Electronic parking brake, stop start button. You got physical buttons everywhere in here. You got dual climate. So the infotainment app suite update is required. Would you like to start downloading it? I mean, you could download it now if you would like. I guess we can go ahead and do it now. Uh, you got your maps 
downloading in the background. I mean, you, you guys pretty much seen how it looked in the last uh, ES video, so. But you got the screen projection as well, so if you got an Android phone, you could use that and it'll project what's, what's on your screen as well. I was downloading it so you guys could see some stuff, but, cause it wasn't gonna let you see anything, but if you guys saw the, the ES video, then you guys would know the regular ES. I'm gonna put that in the video as well. So you got the heated steering wheel, I think you do, let's see. Oh no, that's just for the seating and steering and stuff. Um, yeah, you got a heated steering wheel. Cooled and heated seats. Yeah, my seats are on. Let me turn those off. That's why it's so loud. But um, yeah, there it is right there too. You got your disc player. Excuse me. Yeah. Um, you need a car drum? Yeah, guys, I'm back. <laughs> he asked me about the uh, vehicle that we needed. So um, yeah, sorry about that break right there. Like I said, this this vehicle that's coming up is it? It's a nice little. To me, it's, it's killing it. But uh, we're not gonna talk about that right now. But you got the aux cord, two USBs, cup holder down there as well. Nice touch material. It's like got a little pattern on it. It feels good though too. Got your cup holder right here that you can flip up. It goes all the way down as well. Push that button right here and it flips it back. Got your hold button, your maps. Like I said, it's, there it is right there. Now this one looks a lot updated from the uh, other the LX vehicle that we did. So, like I said, you do get Apple CarPlay in here, and then you got screen projection for your Android phone as well. Um, it's probably not gonna let me do too much just because it's downloading the, the infotainment thing. But um, let's put it in reverse real quick so y'all can see the uh, reverse camera. There it is right there very nice and crisp put that back in park so right here these are your sensor buttons your pre-collision blind spot detection lane switch all of that good stuff um, very nice vehicle man I can't stress it enough soft touch dash soft touch everywhere fifty two thousand dollars is it worth it yes absolutely it's a very nice vehicle that's what I'm saying so that BMW 3 Series that I did was 49000 Didn't look nearly as nice in the inside as this Lexus. So, this is a very nice vehicle. And this is a lot bigger as well, too. I mean, yeah, it's front-wheel drive. Yeah, doesn't matter to me. Um, let's get in the back seat real quick. Check out the leg room and everything. So soft touch materials back here, same thing on that's on the back, that's on the front as well. So get back here, leg room is great. You can see head room is great too. You got that um, sunroof up there. You got the climate back here, so you, the back seat passengers won't burn up. It's not like you can control it back here. Person up there ultimately has control it. But you got the 12 volt charger, two USBs. And uh, also you got cup holders right here. We're not gonna spend too much time on this vehicle just because we reviewed the regular ES and it's pretty much the same. It's just the F sport package on it. So, close that up. And uh, I don't know if I took y'all into the glove box right here, but you got a wireless charging pad right here. And nice amount of sports st storage with the uh, 12 volt charger right there as well. Uh, glove box, you just hit this button right here, it opens it up. And uh, guys, that's pretty much it. Let's see, is that the camera? No, that's not. But um, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys like the video. I'll see you guys in the next. Thank you for watching. I'm gone.